People in Yemen held rallies in solidarity with Palestinians in Gaza, where a genocidal Israeli war since last October has killed more than 34,000 people. Despite heavy rainfall, Yemenis demonstrated in the capital, Sana'a, on Friday, under the slogan, Our battle will continue until Gaza is victorious. Similar rallies were also held in the province of Sa'ada, in northwestern Yemen. The protesters were carrying the Yemeni and Palestinian flags, as well as banners condemning the US-backed Israeli atrocities. They were also chanting slogans in support of the Palestinian resistance factions, and slamming Israel and its staunch ally, the US as criminals. The protesters also slammed some Arab regimes over their failure to take practical steps in support of the Palestinians. Meanwhile, they reaffirmed their support for Yemen's pro-Palestine attacks that hit Israeli targets and ships, as well as the British and American warships. In solidarity with the Palestinians in the besieged Gaza Strip, the Yemeni armed forces have targeted ships in the Red Sea, with owners linked to Israel, or those going to and from ports in the occupied territories. The US and the UK have also been carrying out numerous attacks against Yemen as means of trying to pressure the country into stopping a series of operations that it has been conducting in support of Gazans. Yemen has been conducting operations against the British and American warships that have been dispatched to the Red Sea to confront the Yemeni strikes. Also on Friday, crowds of people gathered near the Israeli embassy in the Jordanian capital, Amman, to express their support for the Palestinians. They also reiterated their call on their government to cut ties with the Israeli regime. From here, from Amman, we say that the Jordanian people, with all their political sensitivities, groups and political powers, stand behind this valiant resistance that has restored the nation's true spirit and declare their rejection of all forms of normalization with the Zionist entity, whether through diplomatic relations or commercial. Reuters quoted Imad al-Mali, one of the protesters, as saying, since the onset of the Israeli war on Gaza, many countries, including the US and Israel's other Western allies, have seen rallies in support of the Palestinians. Israel launched the war on Gaza on October 7th after the Palestinian resistance movement Hamas waged the surprise operation Al-Aqsa Storm against the occupying entity in response to the Israeli intensified violence against Palestinians. Tel Aviv has also blocked water, food and electricity to Gaza, plunging the coastal strip into a humanitarian crisis. Since the start of the offensive, the Tel Aviv regime has killed at least 34,012 Palestinians and injured nearly 76,833 others. Report by Press TV's website.